What's up, guys? It's working Charm City. Charm City Gamer here, back with more Spider Man Fans Battle for Bikini Bottom. It's episode 28. In our last episode, we completed the rest of Sunshine of Three more getting the final spatulas and socks there. Uh, there's only two more worlds that we have to completely 100% before we can get the remaining socks from Patrick and set up to finish the game once and for all. And the first one of those two that we're going to is the Kelp Forest. One of the few levels I can never fully beat as a kid. And I never actually explored the Flying Distance Graveyard in any playthrough of the game, so that would be totally new and random to me. Kelp Forest, it comes first. Here we go. Kelp Forest, what's it center? I can't quite read the sign. I can't. I can't read the sign. Whatever the sign says, if somebody knows what the sign says in the comments, let me know because I'd love to know. Anyway, Kelp Forest, here we go. Here we are in the Kelp Forest, an interesting area with many sights to see. Although you don't get hopelessly lost first. Amen to that. This place is like fucking maze in here. God damn. And that's where these darn flame guys came from. It's supposed to be a jello attack, but I swear it looks like a flame attack. <coughs> no wonder I had so much trouble with them they crashed through. But they actually first appeared here. We didn't come here first. Whatever. <coughs> Right. Farm a bit more tiny, I'm just gonna ride it. And to actually move on, you gotta jump on these plants here. Some of these plants, like that one there, will actually attack you if you come too close. Watch. See what I mean? That plant there, for some inexplicable reason, attacks you if you get too close. I don't know how it does that. And I don't wanna know. I'm starting to think it's possessed. <coughs> yeah, that's just fucking creepy. I planted an attack because you got too damn close. That's just weird and wrong in so many in so many ways. I don't even want to think about that. That kind of stuff will haunt my nightmares for weeks. I don't even have nightmares, it is. But still, it's like what the fuck. Plenty of shiny objects down here. Alright, see a Patrick job. Anyway, let's get up here and see what we got to deal with. Ooh, rag. And there's some more of those little bastards over this way. Take care of you, all right? If you can. Dying. Of course we can. Hmm, I see a pet challenge of some sort. Go bluey! I bet you anything, that'll get us major points. the Patrick and see what the hell we got here. Did I bet you anything there's something around here? We need to Ah, there's a switch. Couple switches. Hmm. How do we hit the switches? Probably have to come over this one later. I don't know. I really don't know, guys. This place is pretty foreign to me. Or be harder with this flame. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out later. Probably on the wrong side of it anyway. Anyway, we'll figure that part out later. Right now, you gotta see what the hell is going on in this place. I feel like a new sponge. Checkpoint. Puff Mama again. What's Puff Mama doing out here? That's what I want to know. Let's find out. Hi, Mrs. Puff. Driving class isn't out here today, is it? 
Uh, no, SpongeBob. Why, why do you say that? Do you think we'd have class out here just to hide from you? <laughs> How silly. I'm just uh, gathering twigs for the winter. Yes, that's it. Oh, right. You think we're stupid or something? Of course you're having class to hide from Sponge. That's the only reason why you go out in this desolate, kelp, viney wasteland thingy. <laughs> Can I help? I have a merit badge in twig gathering. <laughs> merit badge in twig gathering. Lol. <laughs> Actually, you can help with something else. These robots showed up and scared all the students, I mean, the campers off into the forest. Before the ranger arrives, someone needs to go out and find them. And apparently that's me. Alright, seems simple enough. Seems easy enough. I'll Let's help you find them, Mrs. Pop. I'm one. the sponge for the job. Apparently there was a one there I didn't Thanks, see. Thanks, SpongeBob. I'll make sure to give you a nice reward when you found all of them. I shouldn't have hit the A button so soon. Hello again, Mrs. Pop. Good job so far, SpongeBob. But no time to rest now. Let's round these students, uh, campers up before it gets too dark. Okay, Mrs. Pop. I'll keep looking. Hmm. <laughs> Holy shit. Goodbye, bitch. Good news. Man, do I need underwear. Hmm. Oh shit. Get out of the way! She's gonna blow! What we did. What's all this sparkly stuff? Whatever. Oh, you again? Fuck you! Fish stick. Well, at least I get a uh, fresh health here. <laughs> nice callback to the actual to the next game. That is the way you actually switch characters in the next game using the Porto Mirror. <laughs> Over here. That one more shiny object. Ah, I see a throw fruit. Got it, Patrick. I'll take care of you first. Go screw yourself, sir. Holy crap, there's a sock way out there. How am I supposed to get that son of a bitch? How do I get that thing way out there? That's what I want to know. I guess we'll find out later. Right now we're gonna do this kind of part. Watch you at that doghouse, bitch. Damn, I'm good. Okay, at least he's up. Okay, now they take care of him before he more. They're gone. They're gone. Go exploding. Okay. They're all gone. They're all exploding. Okay. Let's get that underwear. Right. I'm betting it's something. There's something out there. What the? Uh, the thing just kind of... Just kind of dropped. I see a drop of Patrick out here. Okay, now how do I get back to where I was? Gotta be a bus stop around here somewhere. Ah, shit! Stop being so inquisitive. Okay, I'll 
Oh no, I thought to see what we can do with this guy right here. Hold me a strat. Awesome. Now, there is one thing we can do to use that, uh, to use that branch thing. I figured out what we can do with Patrick. Let me go back and grab a sock this way. Before we do that, uh, we'll be back with more. I can just suck, guys. Alright, guys, we're back, and like I said, I finally have an idea on what we have to do for Patrick, so let's go switch to him and then use that, uh, use that one freezy fruit we saw up ahead to get us a free stock. Where's that bus stop? <clears throat> Down here somewhere. Not there. Oh, there it is. This is it. Dude, Patrick. Not for those guys. It's up this way. Hello, lady. Nah, <laughs> Patrick's like, hello, lady. Hi, Patrick. Uh, have you seen SpongeBob? If you see him, let him know I'm looking for him. Okay. Sure thing, lady. Lost. <laughs> sure thing, lady. Patrick, you know there. You were just working with her at a, a previous level. How, how do you forget that fast? How many J's, Pat? Makes it best with that. I forget that. I love his animation when you actually are on it and jumping on I still can't believe you forgot who Pup was. That's just funny. Hello, lady. How you forget her? Patrick. Girls are monster combo. There's nothing like the smell no, of bubbles, bubbles in the morning. morning. Smells, Smells like, like victory. victory. Yeah, I'm gonna go back up this way. I know we haven't actually made any forward progress in the level, but you'll see. <clears throat> you'll see what I'm having planned here. You'll see what I can plan. I use the lower levels to get to other places. I went too far down in that. Sponge Wall, obviously, perked in there. It's a water. 
will work. It is the three slot. Like that. Create the pathway up to one of the campers. Ta da! Back up to the top there. Okay, all we need to do is those leaves we just got to get to the camper. Where are they? They're just here. I got a perfect strike, I get a free stack. Number 72. Okay. How is it to get the third three from back? Ah, okay, this is what I was the one with the camper right? I think he's up there. What's happening, guys? Oh, I get it. I think we need Patrick for this. We need Patrick to do that thing. It's an accommodation problem. Patrick has some sort of stem kiki, so it's fun to climb on. Hold on! Sponge Patrick to the rescue! We got two of the seven socks. Five left. Some kind of miracle to get up there. We'll figure that out a little bit. Now let's see if we can't get any further, shall we? Actually, hang on a sec, guys. I want to check something out. Okay, guys, it turns out to get one of the sock, you actually need to um, use the, the tiki so we held it that we destroyed in one Titanic blast earlier. So let me, let me see my progress first. So these two socks are recorded. And then, what we'll do is 
just die intentionally, so that it's take you to respawn. That's what I wanted to do. Go SpongeBob. Go Sam. Go Sam. Alright, what we gotta do here? I'm gonna get this sock. It's a little tricky, but we can pull it off. You gotta sneak up to these tiki's and jump on them. And use them as a springboard to get to the rest of them. Buddy, you're falling a strike right there, doesn't hurt. Damn. Okay, this is gonna be a little trick to pull off. Can't double jump. Gotta hit it on one shot. Okay, this might be a little hard to pull off, guys. Damn. Gotta be close and just jump right when you're close to him. Sneak it. How the hell am I supposed to get to him if I can't do that? How am I supposed to jump on if I can't? Hold on, let me look at the walkthrough again. One second, guys. Okay, guys, this is really easy to figure out, but I think I might have an idea. Here we go. I don't get it. How did they do it if I can't freaking jump? If I can't jump, how do they get there? Sneak mode as you jump or something? I don't know. Let me try another round. Let me try a different round. Can you jump from these rocks on the Let's see. Nope, not gonna happen. How did that get? That didn't work. So you basically have to just poke the hell. This one is Bob. I will not let the peony rock down. Basically, I have to hope the hell you can get the sneak on on those shh tiki over there. And if you can, well, you're good. If not, well, uh, you're in trouble. That was a steady ride, for sure. Too close. I like his sneaking animation there. See that? In the slightest movement will scare him off when you're that close. Damn it! What I gotta do? Annoying. How am I supposed to do this if I can't jump? I can't jump on How am I supposed to do this? Nope. I killed me on the way up there. There's no way to get to it. There's literally no way to get there. There is a way, but it's next to impossible for me to pull off. There's gotta be another way to do this. There simply must be another way. There must be another way to do this. But 
None that I can see. Well, let's try it one more time. That is always awesome to do. See, if I jump, it just scares them off again. Ow. Why the fuck did I do that? Stop that. The one that do like it tells Alright, one last go at it, and then we just give it a break. Basically, you have to land on that first one, otherwise you're screwed. Let me consult another walkthrough here real quick, guys. Hold on. Okay, guys, apparently I was doing this all wrong, so let's try this another way. I was apparently doing this entirely wrong, and then I have to jump from a rock after the TP comes out. Okay, I see. I think I see what I gotta do. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Time to auto-kill myself again. Hold on. Not bad. Thank you. Go in the drink like you're supposed to. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. <laughs> Little affectionate fairy here. Time to bow strap. Steerack, baby. Alright, now. Let's try this again. I think... What we gotta do is jump on this rock here, maybe? No, I can't make a jump from there, can I? Oh, oh where's a try? Yes, I can. Damn it! I would have had it, but the explosion threw me off. Okay, so that's what you gotta do. Let's try that one more time. Alright, let's try that again, guys. We've almost got it. This time I at least know what the hell to do. This one was, is a bitch to get, but it's, it's well designed to make you think. I think I want to waste two stuff. Alright, that time I didn't get the jump over. Okay, alright again. Okay, back down to the rock. I probably went on the wrong rock to begin with. Wasn't it this rock? Nah, I can make a jump from there. Ew, I think it was this rock. Yeah, it was this rock. That rock is too far, isn't it? Yeah, that rock is too far. No, oh, maybe not. Yeah, too far. That rock is too far to jump. It's this rock right here. Damn it! Into the drink, Sponge! Into the drink! Thank you. This is frustrating. Frustrating, yet challenging, yet also so much shit. <laughs> then he was this rock. Let's try. Nope. To the drink! I said to the drink. Thank you. Hold on, guys. We'll be back to try this again in just a second. Okay, guys. Let's give this another shot. And you'll see we farmed a bit of extra... Extra shiny objects. Actually, there's those cameras up there. So, I think what we gotta do, we gotta use this middle rock. And then jump. Hope we can get up there and try the explosion to knock us off. Okay. Ready? Here we go. God damn it! Try it again. I was so close that time. Into the drink! I said into the drink, Sponge! Into the damn drink! Into the water! I said into the drink! Into the drink! Thank you! <laughs> I said into the fucking drink! I want you in the drink! When I say in the drink, you go in the goddamn drink! Right, here we go again. Here we go again, guys. 
this is the most annoying Sonic I've ever had to acquire. But I gotta do it if I want to 100% this game. Here goes nothing. Yep, time to kill. Into the drink again. After auto killing myself. And this again. Another try at it. This son of a bitch. What I gotta do. Nope, kinda die. Okay, maybe Patrick can do it. Let's try it with him. Maybe it'd be better off things with Patrick. Let's try it with him. Maybe just maybe it's better off trying with Patrick. Let's try it with him. Obviously can't use the throw through, but I might be able to just jump my way up there. Let's see. Can Patrick do it? Nope, he can't even make the jump. Ain't no way he can do it. So back to the drawing board. Why is it they gave Patrick the only one that can throw stuff? <laughs> Sounds like that would be Gibby. Nope. To the drink. I said to the damn drink. To the drink. To the drink. Thank you. Mm, this is getting very annoying. Little rock. That time I just missed the jump. I would have hang out up there. I don't think the thunders would have gotten in the way. I just missed the jump. Kablooey, right in the string. I need that sock. I need that fucking sock. I need it. I need it. I so freaking need it. I need that damn sock. Wait a minute. No, you can't throw those. That was the case I would have done that while ago. I need this sock. I need it so bad. Nope. To the drink! This takes me all night, and so be it. But I'm gonna get this damn sock. Time it just got in the way again. To the drink! That time the Tiki got in the way. Like I was like, to the drink! And then I just killed myself. <laughs> He's like, I'm like, people are like, SpongeBob, quit committing auto suicide! <laughs> Timing for this jump is insanely precise. It's like one miss jump, one miss. I mean, you have to be on like a certain spot on the rock and everything. All I gotta do is use the bouncer leaves to bounce my way up there. And then we'll finally get this goddamn sock. Here it goes. Don't 
do this that night, but all the work we did to get it. We got it! Finally! The sock is at last acquired! We finally got it! So much work and we finally fudging got it! And I see another camper out there. That might be the same one. Let me see. Can we get him? Can we get that camper? Would it count in another one? Let's see. Nah, same guy. Well, anyway. At least we got the damn sock. That's all that matters to me. Hello again. Good job, so okay. Anyways, guys, we got the damn sock, the one that had eluded us the entire episode, and that'll do it for this one. So, till next time, Mr. Warcraft Company. Charm City Gamer signing out. Remember to take this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, keep it charming. Victory is ours in terms of getting that sock, guys. We finally got it. It took us forever, but we got it. Till next time, peace.